Hello boys and girls, today we're going to be playing Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. Now, the reason why I'm playing this instead of the original Kingdom Hearts is, first of all, I um, actually haven't played this one out of all of them. I've played a Game Boy version, but, um, PlayStation version intrigued me a bit more. Um, and also because <coughs> of the, um, twist at the end of this one, um, it's not a spoiler because it's it's different put it that way basically there's two campaigns and the way to unlock the second one is by completing Sora's um, and uh, I believe um, as soon as Sora's has been completed uh, something will pop up underneath rechanged of memories in the menu hopefully so if not, then we'll find out in the game. So let's start a new game. We're gonna do proud because we are now. Uh, no vibrations, please. I'm using an emulator for this, by the way. If any of you are wondering, the reason why I'm saying that is because um, if there's any bugs or anything, that'll be why. Or if you see any pop-ups, that'll be why. But I'm using a uh, controller, so should work to say. Uh, play audience. The stereo, please. Yep. This is the game which I think um, was the most anticipated for me. I'll be quiet for the intro. Enjoy. Yeah, I'm just gonna say this now, there is lag. But that's only you join the intro for some reason. It shouldn't happen during the game. So I guess I'll talk over the top of it to uh, um, reduce the problems with people watching the video. So, yeah, this is basically the recap of Kingdom Hearts 1. I don't. I like the fact that the Kingdom Hearts games does do, um, do this, so if you haven't played any of the Kingdom Hearts games before, starting off with a completely new one because that's the one they told you to start off with, um, it gives you a nice little, this is what happened previously. So yeah, while I'm playing this game, um, put in the comments if you are interested in me playing any of the other the parts games. Um, I can play the DS games as well. I think I attempted to recode it a while ago, but that game made me um, very angry at the time. But um, I wouldn't mind, you know, digging out that playthrough. I've still got um, the game and all that sort of stuff, so. It's still a possibility, but um, at the moment I'm going to be focusing on this game. I think out of all the games which I'm going to be playing on, uh, I think I'm going to play on this. Yeah, drugs. <laughs> Come on, guys, let's go. Yeah, yeah, we're so happy. And then hell initiates. So 
So this is a direct sequel to the first one, so... Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, the first Along game... Along the road ahead lies something you need. However, in order to claim it, you must lose something that is dear to you. Nominee. I'm just going to throw this out there. Each time, whenever you see her draw, take note of what pencil she's using. Because, apparently, she has a range of different colours, and she only ever uses one pencil, and it's, it's not colourful, it's not a colour pencil, hard to change your memories, it's not, um, like a colour, um, one of those, like, multicolour pencils or anything like that, no, it's a black pencil, because you see her using it later on. The only reason why I know that is because the Game Boy version tries to make these cutscenes. I say try very loosely. Oh. What I'm thinking of doing alongside this is, um... Kingdom Hearts 338, um, 358 over two days. I'm surprised I remember that. Um, because that takes place alongside of this. As you may already know, the cutscenes won't be great because they. Um, hey, you think it's okay to barge in? Yes, but absolutely. We can't do it if we can afford the king. The king? King Mickey's here? Santa just told me he'd be here, okay? Really? Because now that you mention it, I was kind of thinking the same thing. Seriously? Me too. One look at this castle, and I just knew. Our very best friends, they're here. <laughs> Guess great minds think alike. Wait, hey, hold on. It can't be just a coincidence. Oh no, Kimmy. You don't mean that. Yep, I had it too. Mm hmm. I had the exact same feeling. Gorge! Maybe it's contagious. Oh god, I thought too. Something screwy. We gotta go take a look. Alright. <laughs> Where are you going? That way, to the door. <laughs> are you scared? I'm gonna throw this out there right now, a different boy chapter. Come on, let's go, Dizzy. Hey, fellas, uh, shouldn't we shut the door behind us before we go? Sora! That's it. Who are you? <laughs> I am Morgan Freeman. Ah, hi, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, it was a magic. Sega. The hat I'm using. Come on. Sega. Sega. Your powers do not work on Morgan Freeman. I Come will be here on. narrating your journeys yes, throughout the game. Nada. Have you seen the film, Bruce Almighty? I should think it's obvious. I am Morgan The moment Freeman. you set foot in this castle, you forgot every spell and every ability you ever knew. In this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. That is the way in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? Yep, definitely Morgan Freeman.
Here you will meet people that you have known in the past. And you will meet people you miss. I miss? Riku! You mean Riku's here? If what you want is to find him. I thought it was a learn that Morgan Freeman cannot be killed. What'd you do? I merely sampled your memories, and from them, I made this. Transverse Town. To reunite with those you hold dear. What's this? A card? It is a promise for the reunion you seek. Hold the card to open the door, and beyond it a new world. Proceed, Zora. To lose and claim anew. Or, to claim anew, only to lose. Definitely Morgan Freeman. He's gonna come back. He's gonna say, Come on! Hello there, Zora. Let's go! I am here to narrate your, the, um, your life. You will get annoyed with me, but I shall not care, for I am God. And that's basically how he is in every single film. Also, me and walking forward. Hang on, this is unfair. There are five cards in front of him there, and we only get one. Oh well. Let's go. This is the one I chose! You get to walk in the door because I listen to Morgan Freeman. Right. Oh yeah, I forgot to say. Well, I didn't forget to say. I did say, but I don't know if you guys. Did. Hello. Oh God. What did you do, God? What did you do? <laughs> Don't give him the gambling. So basically, if you guys don't know, this is basically a long-winded version of um, um, the battle system in uh, Kingdom Hearts 1. <laughs> Dodge roll, jump. First, think for yourself. Move the cards, then use. You now know how to use it. your strength. I wonder if you can. Oh. He's definitely more can Freeman. He can fly and everything. Yeah. 
Ah, okay, I see. You can recall spent cards at any time. Anticipate the flower battle and choose the more effective cards. Okay, this is gonna get some get used to. Um, start off with a no. Ah. What types of cards? Are not the first card: attack, magic, and item. Enemy cards. Oh yeah, these are closed for the settings uh, and for the setting up of Kingdom Hearts 2. Okay, so this game works a bit more like um, Final Fantasy games. You'll find out why in a second. Sort of, uh, the newer Final Fantasy games, I'd say. Final Fantasy 10 to Final Fantasy um, 13 and 13 to are good examples of this. Basically, you can avoid fights. However, if you get into them, yeah, I, I, I think I, I think I established this when I, you know, did the whole tutorial. Thank you very much. And that's telling me down how to hit a battle. Um, hit a barrel, not a battle. Right, this one controls a bit differently. It's a setup for uh, Kingdom Hearts 2, as I said. So a lot of the stuff will be different from the first game. The reason why I'm telling you this is because if any of you want to play this game and um, you haven't played um, any of the other Kingdom Hearts games apart from the first one, then it will uh, feel a bit weird. That's what I mean by Final Fantasy style. As soon as you hit it, you'll enter this mode. Excuse me, I. It's weird though because I'm using the um, I'm using the analog um, stick to look. What? No. Come on, reload. Give. Okay. Oh, good. I keep wanting to look around using L2 and R2. Tranquil Darkness. Oh yeah, these cards are used as locks. So, try to go in front of the door, yada yada yada. Is there a save point yet? I hope so. See, um... Okay. They, they get the idea. Right. So, we can use this one later on, but at the moment we have to use this one, I think. So basically, 
this takes us up one level. And uh, we want to try and find a zero. Because that will take us straight to the exit, I think. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah, I'm going to leave it here for now, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I actually <laughs> quite like this game at the moment. It's different to my normal stuff. I'm still going to play Metro uh, 2033. Got um, four episodes ready. I'm going to upload two tomorrow since I missed one last week. And I'm going to um, upload some other videos, other parts. There'll be more Super Mario soon, and along with uh, Kingdom Hearts Recoded. And there'll also be more um, what other games I haven't finished off yet, because I'm not at school this week. I've got exams <coughs> that <coughs> are in two weeks' time, which means videos will be more rare. That's why I'm going to try and get as many videos up as possible during the next week so i hope you enjoyed this i certainly am uh this is just one of the two campaigns so yeah i'm going to finish this one i from what i've seen uh it's gonna take at least um it's gonna <coughs> <coughs> without like these random breaks i guess just you know to the outro um, it's probably going to take up to 3 hours in total, so I'm going to try to do 20 minute parts to make things easier. So that way, you know, I'll... See, here's my mouse. I told you it was an emulator. But, um, I'm still using PlayStation 2 controller. So, any more games you want me to play or anything like that, please leave, um, a comment or two, so that way I know. Subscribe, like, yada yada, whatever you want, I don't really care. Um, and yeah, goodbye guys.